I'm going to circle. I'm not going to go too close. I'll say hello soon, but not yet. Mm. Pardon? The lake is not frozen. There is one particular tree on, on the lake of, uh, of Kushero, um, which I first stumbled on in, in the winter of uh, in January 2002, I believe. So I've probably visited it, yeah, I don't know, a dozen times since then at different um, times that I've been around Kushero. Um, when I first photographed it, it almost had the feeling of being a bonsai tree. <laughs> um, very uh, stark, very scaleless, very beautifully Japanese in its way. And each time I would return, uh, one of the limbs fell off the tree or it changed completely. And now it's almost a kind of a stooping um, old lady figure somehow that kind of stretches out over the, uh, over the lake. I do feel that I'm photographing as a portrait photographer when I, when I, when I talk to the trees and I photograph the trees. Um, you know, I like to think that I'm not, not a paparazzi, that I, I run in, snap a picture, and, and run back out again. Uh, I don't think that's fair. I wouldn't do it with a human, so I don't see why I should do it with the landscape. With trees, as with humans, the more time you meet them and uh, become familiar with them, the, the friendly they are. And the more you know about them, the more subtle and deep uh, the relationship becomes.